Telet Wireless Solutions, a global enabler of the Internet of Things, today announced a collaboration with the Google Cloud Platform to launch the first IoT Big Data comp uh, Challenge, rather, a competition aimed at promoting and accelerating innovation around the Internet of Things. And we're joined here with Fred Yentz uh, of ILS Technology. And Fred, welcome to the program. Oh, good to be here, Abe. I'm uh, glad to have you, Fred. A big announcement this morning. I uh, picked up on a, uh, a number of news wires that I noticed uh, throughout the day. Um, what does this mean for the industry as you bring some pretty powerful platforms to build the best-in-class IoT solutions? Well, I think it's uh, one is very important, I think, to the industry because what we're really doing through this IoT Big Data Challenge and the cooperation between Google and Telet is we're bringing two very, very strong platforms together. The first platform is really consuming this information from the IoT domain, and that's the, the Telet MTEM Air Cloud platform, which is powered by DeviceWise. And then on the repository side and on the applications analytics and big data query side of the business we're bringing a powerful platform from Google which is the Google uh, cloud platform solutions so together uh, we think that we're bringing uh, really a best-in-class pair of platforms to solve the real-world IOT challenges that we all have in front of us today is, is really opportunities Fred, of course, uh, as you know, there's a December 2nd webinar about this confluence of platforms to illustrate how the development community will engage. Can you tell us more about that? So it's all about making sure that development and the development community is engaged with the pair of platforms. Uh, from a Telet and an ILS point of view, we have a pretty robust community of device-wise users, which uh, which we want we're bringing to the table and and. Uh, Google on the Google Cloud platform, they have a, an, a, an endless number of, develop, of developers uh, on that platform as well. So we're we're merging the two platforms together for the purposes of this challenge. We're creating the correct technical linkages between them and giving uh, the IoT data um, to the to the the Google development community so that they can really create some uh, some new innovative solutions. Now, of course, uh, in conjunction with this uh, December 2nd IoT uh, webcast kickoff, if you will, uh, can you give us some more details about the IoT Big Data Challenge as well? So there's going to be numerous solutions, a solution set geared towards business, a solution set geared towards consumer, and uh, sort of a why didn't I think of that type of a solution where we're really trying to explore, you know, the innovative side of the development community to see what they will do with all of this newfound information that's available to them. Um, and, and you hit you hit the nail on the head, Abe. We want to make sure that a few key dates are relevant and aware. Uh, we're going to have a kickoff webinar uh, for the community, which will be a global webinar, uh, which is going to be December 2nd. Uh, that's at 11 a.m. Eastern. We hope that we can catch the end of the European day, and clearly we can catch the beginning of the uh, the West Coast here in the U.S. Uh, that'll be uh, available for replay as well for anybody who, who does not make that date. Um, and that'll be basically the kickoff of the, of the challenge. Uh, yeah. Folks can register uh, for the challenge at that point in time, and then they will have about a month uh, to complete their projects and their applications. And there'll be a submission uh, time frame and a judging of applications that'll take place beginning January 9th. Now, there are two more. You mentioned two significant dates. December 2nd, of course, is the webcast. January 9th is a submission. Is that a deadline, by the way, Fred? Uh, yeah, certainly the January 9th date will be a deadline for submission. That's when we'll begin the judging of the applications. And the, uh, the really neat thing about this is the awards or the uh, the recognition of the of the key participants and projects will happen in two different venues. The first venue will be January 27th in Miami at the DeviceWise Global Summit, which is you know our user community event, which is uh, right in front of MTEM Evolution down in Miami. And then a very the very next week on February 3rd will have an event at the Google location in, U in the UK, in London, at their uh, cloud platform event to recognize the uh, participants from, from Europe and EMEA. 
And Fred, once again, for our viewers, in case, you, in case you didn't catch that, that's the Google Cloud Platform event that is in London on February 3rd of early next year. Um, Fred, is there anything, is there, well, first of all, what's the best way to access the information for all of, the, all, all of this? So we've launched a uh, website to talk about the event, and that's tellitgcp, the number four, iot.com. So tellitgcp4iot is the URL to catch. Uh, to see what's going on, get information about the webinar, the calendar, and the uh, criteria. Now, can you watch the webinar straight from that website? Is that how it works? Uh, that'll be registering for the webinar. The webinar will be a live streaming webinar. Uh, there will be a replay option post the webinar. I'm sure it'll be available with links uh, to that website also. Fred, thanks so much. Again, a big announcement. We're excited here at TIA to hear about it, and we're also excited to be down in Miami for your event um, to do some more coverage about the announcement as well. Thank you. Great. Thank you, Abe. Thanks, Fred.